All right. Uh, I don't actually know what's the premise of the game right now, so I basically put a generic title for this one. We'll see what happens next, and as I progress through the game, I'll find out more. I'm hoping it doesn't crash. I think I fixed the issue. I did. No. I did. Okay. So pretty much the issue was that I had the FPS uncapped. So when I capped it to 60, that fixed my issue of, of constantly crashing. So in case you are in the same situation as me and you're using Special K, uh, that's the way to go. It should just cap it to 60. Okay, so I don't know much about this game so far, so I'm going to go ahead and actually just ex experiment a little bit. So first things first, just like Unity, I'm just going to check to see what this side quest stuff is. And then depending on what this is, I'll either skip it or I'll, I'll actually do it. it. It depends on if 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 I find it fun, you know, so we'll see. Also, it looks like they removed the interior sections that they had in Unity, which is very interesting. I'm not sure why they did that, but I guess they kind of wanted this to be the budget one or something because of the because of how, because of how Unity tur turned out, you know. And it would make sense. I'd be surprised to see some interior stuff in the overworld. Okay. Must be one of the clinkers. Good place to start. Where is that guy? Oh, there's some interior places. Wow. Dude, move. Please, get the hell out. Okay. I actually did not mind that, so I guess I'll do these as well. Is this like sequences? Okay. Sequence three. It is... Alright. I assume I need to do these and these are just part of the mission. Okay, so there are chests, helix glitches. Helix glitches are usually boring. I wonder if they've made any changes to them. seem to want my employer's attention, Mr. Fry. Oh, I positively crave it. But you'll do for now. As you like. Oh, my God. 
Uh, where is it? Skills. Okay. I think they've done it. They've done a good job so far with this. This is all melee damage. No, I don't want that. This will probably be a good, good sign. Two. Okay. Kind of want to unlock all, all of them right now, but I just I don't know. Kind of don't want to do that right now. We'll do it later. I think I'm level 2, right? No, I should be able to equip that inventory that I got. The belt? Yeah. There we go. Whoops. I'm sorry. Didn't mean to just jump in there. Oh, it looks like they... Okay, that's interesting. So the helix glitches are now different. That's good to know. So that's a waste of my time. Will not be doing that. Vintage beer bottles. Let's see what this is. It's also a waste of time. Good to know. Let's see, this is fast travel. Illustration, okay. So, beer bottles are a waste of time. Helix is a waste of time. Let's see the illustrations. Okay, that's a waste of time. Good to know. <laughs> so far, three things I've done is not, uh, it's not worth the time. Go to the shop. Okay, don't need this. I wonder if there's different shops now. I'll go on this one and then I'll go on this one after.
lot of people. Okay, so each shop gives me the same type of options, which means when new options are open, I will, uh, I will just speak to one of them and see what I can get. Good to know. Whoa. Are you an assassin? Alright. <laughs> Alright, so I guess I'll just do the main story stuff and if something new opens up, I'll give it a shot and see if I like it. But uh, until then... What is this? Guessing that's 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 a sink point, most likely. No? Okay. Oh, you know, this actually kind of brings up, like, I just thought about this just now. Um, I think there's going to be a lot of racist comments for the new Assassin's Creed, and I think a lot of people will not buy it because of that. Should be very interesting, because you will be climbing a lot of stuff, right? And I think people will uh, link that to something, I'm sure, you can, if you uh, live in the United States, you know what type of thing that they will say, most likely. What? What is this? I guess I climbed up there to get that book, which means that's also a waste of time. Good to know. Maybe. Templar Hunt seems pretty fun. Hey, what's up, dude? I mean, one. I think when Unity was released, a part of the reason why they they actually have two separate protagonists is because when Unity was released, some people like made articles about, about it being very sexist. Which is the reason why they have two different people. Okay, so Templar hunts are fun. Not bad.
Okay. Good. So far, it looks like uh, the best way to do this is, is to just go for the uh, giant octagons. Octagon symbols. I don't see Mr. Abelard. Well, we tried. Psst. I may know a thing or two about that splendid fellow you're talking about. What's this? Are you trying to blow the gaff? What? Sergeant Abelard, at your service. I presume you're the Fry Twins Green mentioned. I was expecting you to be a policeman. I was expecting you to be discreet. Henry Green said that you could help us go unnoticed. This is how it will work. I will give you the names of criminal gang members. You will bring them back to me. Quietly. Oh, we'll be as quiet as an old lady. A very hairy, strange old lady that looks a lot like a policeman. They really like zooming in on uh, her face. <laughs> Happens pretty constant. Try to remain within the bounds of the law, for my sake. I don't need any corpses at the station. Approach the target from behind and attempt to make them talk. Then bring them to my carriage, carefully. Okay. Kidnapping, huh? Be to kidnap them, okay. God, I don't know where to go. Oh, crap, crap, crap. What is it that you think I've done? Collecting rent from people who don't owe you a shilling. Yeah, me and half the Richies in this bloody city. You gonna kidnap them too? Maybe. But I'm starting with you. Don't call for help. Come on. 
Oh, this is a weird mission. Keep moving. Steady on. I think this carry stuff was a good idea by them. But there's a significant lack of just Easy, dirty Easy. roads and poop. Let's go. Cause if you look at the pictures from this era, the roads were uh, filled with that. That's the way. We'd be glad to see him behind bars. Thank you. Kind of wish there was a faster way to see my skill points, but I guess, yeah, I only have one. All right, I want to see what what I should get next. Thinking. This is probably a good one because this will significantly make my strength faster. Yeah. Like as in I'll be able to dispatch them a lot more quicker, so. Just need one more skill point. I know that I can use the fast travel system, but I just want to explore the world more, you know? What is this place? It's nice to meet you both at last. This is Babylon Alley. Here we make it our business to know the streets and provide children with the opportunity to control their own destinies. Clara, Mr. Green said we might be able to help one another. In exchange for our services, we ask a small favor. Well, why not? You seem to have taken most of my money. 
Why not take a small favor, too? There are several factories about the city that are powered almost entirely by child labor. Those children work long hours with little pay, and most are not permitted even to leave the factory grounds. They suffer terribly. I need you to save them. A small favor. In return, we offer you intelligence, something you clearly need. Oh, hold on a minute. I'm late for an appointment. What are these terms? We accept. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you. It's weird. I wonder if that was a tradition back then to make a promise or something or to make a deal. Oops, sorry. Nice. Come to Papa. I like that he's just waiting for his turn. The hell, dude? What are you doing? You got a problem? Yeah, that's right. Keep on walking. I'm not sure what am I supposed to do now. Am I done with this? Okay, I am. No, it's up top, okay. Interesting. Guessing there's one more here somewhere? Yeah, up top. Don't 
better be the last of him. Keep quiet. I'm here to help. Thank you, sir. It's kind of unfortunate that the next Assassin's Creed is not going to use the combat system like this, because this combat system is really good. Like, you, you, even though I'm just smashing X, it just, uh, it feels, feels great, you know? Ah, there you are. All that stands between you and Whitechapel is the villain controlling the borough. Kaylock has demanded you settle the claim for territory in a gang fight. His loss? Here. I'm sure you can put this to better use than I can. Oh, what's this, Greeny? Assassin Christmas. <laughs> Gather your allies. Oh, okay. So I can just purchase it through the inventory system. It's good to know. Mr. Rexford Kaylock has agreed to your terms and waits for you at the Whitechapel train station. He's bet his train on the fight. No Kaylock. Hmm. No matter. Attack! What am I doing?
to be broken. Oh well, at least we have a train now. It's not all bad. I'd rather throw myself to the tracks and run Bertha another mile for that doughty bow bag. Kaylock? <laughs> He's left the station. Mel, hello, fancy pants. I knew my you I'm Evie Fry, and this is my brother, Jacob Fry. Pleased to meet you. I'm Agnes McBean. A delight. I thought I was getting a promotion. I suppose I'm out of work now. Come work for us instead. <laughs> I won't bail your heat. You pay better than scraps? Oh, I'm sure we can at least match that. Then may I present to you Agnes and Bertha, lady and locomotive, at your service. I'll be in the next car. A hideout on the rails? What an excellent idea. Yes, it all worked out rather well. Now, I would like to follow up a lead on... Jacob? Is this serious? I'm not doing anything until this gets fixed. I believe I know someone who can help with that. I knew you would, Greeny. It's kind of hard to read the characters. One moment, uh, I need to turn off the AC. Be right back. Okay. You know, a might of money goes a mickle bit in this city. Think of the power of good you can do with the purse you bring. Great. You talk of a store in London. Well, now's your chance. That there map shows who to speak to. Old friends, if you will. Give a whiff of that sterling, and maybe you can save us all from having to lay down our knife and fork afore we're ready. Okay. This seems better, so I'll just wait for this. Now, enough shop talk. Believe Mr. Green said there was someone he wanted you to meet.
Loading is taking a long time because I have the game on SSD, so it shouldn't take that long. And yet here we are. I don't get it. Alright, whatever. I'm not sure how the train stuff works. Maybe you hitch a ride and it gets you there faster or something. But I don't know. Um, I got two skills. So I'm going to put this. To this. It's going to be a long run, but it's going to be worth it, I think. looks pretty good. Probably hit your ride on one of these, but yeah, I'll, I'll hit your ride, especially here. Watch out! Easy now! Who's a good horse? You are. Guilty. Beg your pardon. You, you're the one. I assure you, we've never met. Is this a prize fighting ring? You bet your eyes and ears it is, my lord, my lady. The name's Robert Topping. Best bookie in all of London at your disposal. Well, second best, but my mum says Don's a bit of an income poop. Anyhow, I can show you a vast array of exciting things, from prize fights to carriage races. I think we can afford to spend a little time here. Step right up, only the best of the best. 
It should be pretty easy for me. <laughs> I knew you'd come. Good luck in there. Not that you'll need it. Hurry now, next. Push her stay on his champion to be <laughs> Is this another one or is this the same one? I think it's the same one, right? I mean, if it's the same thing over and over again, it's kind of pointless. Well, not really pointless, but it doesn't give a lot of reward, you know? Not worth it. Uh, what else? My carriage is not parked there, right? Is that my carriage? No, it's not. 
But it's there, so might as well. Steady on. Curious to see how difficult this is. I assume I just won't do a lot of damage because it's level 6. Wow, they actually do a lot of damage to me. One hit, dude. Having levels in Assassin's Creed game feels weird. I can probably do these, although like taking one hit kind of sucks because the amount of time I have to react to them is very little. So what I'll do instead is I'll just go for these and get the uh, towers done first before I move on to the next area, I guess. So, so, so I guess the plan is to, well, I should just keep on working towards here. So the plan is, I guess, to go down here, get this, get this, and then head down more. And then go for this one. Because I'm sure that they're going to lead me all acro across the map, right? So, so when I'm in a section like that, I'll just do the stuff there. Do the ac activities there, I, I, should, I should say.
looks like they've uh, improved upon the climbing aspect as, as well. It doesn't look as like clunky. the smoothest stealth kill I've done. I know I'm climbing a lot, and it's not as fun to climb, but, you know, it's something that you gotta do, you know. Okay, here we go. Am I going to the wrong building? I am. Wow, that's great. Yep. Fantastic. No, all of these games are pretty much Skinner boxes, right? And this is one of their... Um, their skinner box things that works really well for them is that going to climb the tower to un unlock most of the map or whatever or more of the map and the reward is to get more of the map and the task is to climb the tower in this case this building but I think uh, the, the the game that did the climbing the, the best was the Shadow of the Colossus. It was really good. It's awesome. Oh, I went for the wrong one, I guess? I, <laughs> I thought I changed it. Oh well, whatever.
Yep, pretty much. <laughs> That's right, Lazarus. But hey, this will be the final um, game that I will stream, so... After this, uh, I will definitely play Origin. Um, I haven't bought it yet, but I in intend to when it's a bit ch cheaper. Like, I'll get it when it's like 30 bucks. We should, uh, ho hopefully the website that I buy stuff from will have it, so... Um, I got, uh, Evil Within 2. And I got uh, the new Wolfenstein. Um, Wolf Wolfenstein 2, I think? I got them both uh, for like $35, which is pretty good for a game that hasn't even been released yet, you know? So, so I'm, I'm hoping that the Assassin's Creed game is also there, but we'll see. Apparently the new one is supposed to have like Dark Souls-y type of combat, so I'm kind of looking forward to seeing how that plays out. I kind of like this more, but that's all right. The combat, you know, it's pretty good. Everything you need, right here. Right. So <laughs> I might as well take this since I'm here. Level 7 is probably going to one-shot me. Goddamn. Really want to kill it, but... Let me see. Whoops. I did my job, right? That's it. I mean, do I have to eliminate them all? I think I need to eliminate them all, which means I kind of have to be stealthy. disappointing to hear but it should be fine I think I mean I'm still fine even though it's like very even though I'm like level 2 I think and I'm killing like level 7 enemies so it's not bad Very careful. Fudge! Damn it. I should have just ran away, but I don't know. Got cocky. This is my first time dying in this game, so we'll see where it lands me.
<laughs> oh my god. He's beating the shit out of this guy. Yeah, uh, yeah, they started doing that a while back, actually. Um, this game has skill stuff, too, which is right over here. Um, the other game, which was Unity, also had this, so... Yeah. They also have, have loot and stuff in this game, too. It has, like, the gauntlets, firearms, etc., etc. It's kind of meaningless, though, in my opinion, because the formula is kind of the same, so it's... Like it doesn't really matter in my opinion. But whatever. It's cool. I think Egypt is gonna be uh, pretty cool though, uh, because it's basically taking. One sec. It's basically uh, taking like where it all started, which is kind of cool. So you get to see everything. I think the brightness for this right right now is too high, so I'm gonna probably lower that down. After this. But at the same time, like, they kind of, like, just didn't even bother with the Desmond story anymore. They kind of just like, Desmond, who's that? So it's kind of pointless, I think. Not pointless, but, you know, it's unfortunate. Because uh, if you were following the story of Assassin's Creed uh, from the beginning to all the way to the second part with Desmond and Ezio, like, that story, you know, was about goddesses and stuff like that. And then they kind of just like a ancient, you know, civilization that basically led humanity and blah, blah, blah. And then... There's a meteor that that's, that's gonna crash that ruined their civilization, so they created this thing to make it so that... So that, um... One sec. It's kinda making me motion sick, I don't know why. Um, so that humanity does not suffer the same fate. And then eventually one of them betrayed them and... Then after that, they kinda never really expanded upon the story, they kinda just killed off... Desmond, and then that was that. And now we're just in these simulations. And... I, I don't know. I've been following this story, but uh, <laughs> I don't think they're gonna continue that. Because they actually fired the guy, or laid off the guy that was writing the story for the game, so... Um, that's why the game kind of has taken a new direction with the story and stuff, but... But they kept some of the the the, char the characters. Um, uh, Rebecca and Sean are are from Assassin's Creed Two stuff, you know, with, with Desmond Miles and like whatnot. But I I know that a lot of people don't care about that, so it's it's whatever. At least they're bringing some of the the, the characters back. I'm curious to see how how this goes. Because the 
artifacts of Eden were supposed to be like these very crazy artifacts with a lot of power. And one of them was actually shown in Assassin's Creed Unity, but in this one, like, like right at the beginning, they just destroyed it. It's like, what? How do you destroy that? But I'm probably like one of the very few people that is or that are disappointed by uh, the direction that they took, but that's all right. Maybe they'll expand upon it in Origins, but I kind of doubt it. I, I don't think that they're, they're going to take that risk, but we'll see when the game is there. thinking and where I should go. I guess I'm gonna jet for this and see what happens. I'm kind of close to it. I'm going to try this. Probably going to die, but that's all right. I'm not gonna take those risk stuff anymore. I'll just wait until I'm the appropriate level. Because even though I push it on time, uh, it still doesn't really matter, so... I'll just wait. I'm kind of looking forward to uh, Metal Gear Solid 2, and that should be really good. But I have to set up my PlayStation 3 again, which is fine. And then uh, I think Metal Gear Solid 4 came out on PlayStation 3 as well, so... I think if Kojima was still working with um, Konami... I, th I think all those games would have been already released on the PlayStation 4, but he's not, so. But that's definitely going to be my, my last game. Like, regardless of how good the, the new one is from Konami, I kind of don't care. Because the person that actually led those games in the story and whatnot was Kojima, so... Once he's gone, it's kind of over, you know, because because it, it was his story, and since he's not writing it, it doesn't matter.
alright. Can I give them a penny? Let's see. Them. Alec, whatever is the matter? I have been intercepting nothing but poppycock propaganda about soothing syrup and whatnot. No, I swear to high heavens, if Starrick's monopoly continues... Alec, I beg your pardon. These are friends of mine. Evie Fry and her brother, Jacob. Oh, um... Alexander Graham Bell. Linguist, inventor and technical expert. Alec, I have something of a favor to ask you. Can you fix this? Oh, looks like the casing is cracked. Oh, comes apart. <laughs> I see. Could have used one of these to fit my fuses on top of Big Ben. Alec is installing a new telegraph line for our Free Press Association. To combat the Static Telegraph Company. Now, if I can mend the fuses connecting independent lines from Big Ben, Static will be weakened. Only we are somewhat at a handicap. And there. Oh, I've removed the mechanism, so it may work with your bracer. I'll put it to use immediately. <laughs> Jacob, wait. Mr. Bell, allow me to help you with your fuses. Oh, you will not find me too proud to accept Miss Fry. Oh, uh, we can use my carriage if you'd be so good as to hold the reins, though. I'll take that. Um, I, I can help you. Miss Fry, I am so glad you could assist me. Okay, I gotta level up the skills. Giddles. Okay. This kind of seems not that useful. This seems good. Uh, what is this? What the hell did I just buy? I thought I bought this. Oh, okay, I bought the second one. I guess I'm gonna wait. Yeah. I think I'll keep a regular outfit actually. You really ought to be here by now. So, Mr. Bell, what inventions are you concocting? I intend to develop a phonetic telegraph that does not just convey dots and dashes, Miss Fry, but the human voice. Phonetic telegraph? Hmm. Sounds a bit of a mouthful. You could just call it a telephone. Telephone? How <laughs> bizarre. Anyway, as I was saying earlier, the price has become entirely dependent on the static telegraph company. Which is why Mr. Green has asked you to set up a free line. Yes. What is more, other small independent companies have had their lines sabotaged. 
and they have little means of finding any broken fuses, which are... To be found on top of Big Ben. Correct. Especially as one needs a special government pass to get through the guards. Uh, they will not be a problem. I'll repair the fuses. Easy, girl. Come on. You guys are just gonna sit there? Yeah, you guys just sit there. This seems really good. Can I do it here? I mean, I'm kind of trying to do it, but it's not happening. Ah, whatever. Keep on going! I'm not really, like, stomping. I'm just holding it down and she just, like, takes a breather. She's like, okay. Oh, it says something about zip lining. Wonder how does that work? Whoa. Okay. That's cool. It's really cool. I'm kind of not sure what de determines it to like hit the hit the zip line though. No idea. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So this is actually from I think Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. I think it's from Brotherhood. They they had this type of mechanic, which was really nice. But they never have it had it be like a zip line as well, so so that's kinda new. Makes traversing much better. That's awesome. This was unexpected. <laughs> this feature is awesome. It's really good. I'm gonna use that a lot more. That should do it. That's 
not what I wanted to do, but that's all right. I think uh, it would be awesome to have like a mod that just allows me to just do that anywhere, you know? That'd be so sick. Oops. Thank you very much, Miss Fry. I will now be able to continue with the installation of the new line. If there's anything else I can do to help... Uh, certainly. Please do come and visit. Oh, uh, I was toying with this device and have noted down the formula for you. It's not perfect yet, but by golly, it works. Okay, what's next? Loot. Don't need it. I feel like I'm slowly progressing the story for, for this, but it doesn't seem like... Like... The story itself seems kinda... Like, I just feel like I'm just beginning at the story, which is true. So I'm hoping that it picks up speed at some point. Soon, hopefully. Because right now I'm just like, hey, you got this new gadget, you got this other new gadget, great. But, but I do like that, uh, the zipline thing though, it's really cool. And also the fact that like there is moving levels is also kind of cool. I just wish that the water quality was a bit better, but that's alright. But then again, like, <laughs> you know, it's like kind of a meme at this point. Nice water. Because, like, business as usual, some women just ran up here on the boat and just started climbing. I 
I assume I have to go there. That's probably a primary mission to progress the story forward, so... I'm gonna go to them. A lot of birds. <laughs> oh, okay. That guy's dead. pick him up huh did I not kill him I thought I killed him yeah I might as well throw him in the water I think he's dead so pretty sure he's dead I stabbed him Get out of Gosh, she's so good at this. Nope. 
definitely not finding hidden chests. You just need some medicine, dude. Medicine pouch. Oh, wait. I guess they really want me to craft something, so... Um... Not quite sure where to go next. Don't think I have like a... Yeah. Hmm. It's weird. I don't know what am I missing then. Doesn't make sense. Okay, I still gotta craft something. I don't know what to craft though. Doesn't make sense. Maybe gear. This seems like a good upgrade, actually. Let's see what happens when I press get crafting resources. Oh, look at this. Helix credits. Ultimate. Yeah, let's get the ultimate crafting resources pack. Oh, yeah. Let me purchase these credits. Only $20? Oh, that's a steal right there, dude. <laughs> uh, Goddamn. But why can't I craft that? It doesn't make sense. I can't craft anything, then why do they even want me to be here, dude? just told me what they want me to upgrade so I, I would just do that and get that over of it but no idea I mean technically I have the money for this so I don't get why I, I can't do it Driver doesn't want, doesn't matter. Okay. All 
Alright, so I just need two of these and I can just destroy them. Cool. Well, at least it's not asking me to do that. That's, that's good. Kind of don't like the fact that it was just forcing me to upgrade when I didn't want to. I kind of want to get that before I get this mission, so I'll do that first. I'm gonna play for 10 more minutes and I'm gonna call it. Oh, right, I can just use my zip, room, zip line to do that more often. Fry, uh, I was just showing Jacob the first message was received via the mended lines. Oh, uh, you can keep the rope launcher, by the way. Um, we've managed to procure another one for your brother. Excellent work. Thank you again. You're very welcome, Mr. Bell. We can now defend the principle of impartial news and free speech. Free is fair, but free and brief is far better. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, Fry, such caustic wit. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, we must depart. <laughs> oh, uh, good fortune to you both. Uh, call on me at any time. Outdoors man's outfit, okay. Now that we've finished with that distraction. Who is that? Oh, you mean you don't know? Beautiful train you got here. Miss McBean was just telling me all about her. Name's Ned. How do you do? I won't take up more of your time. Uh, if you want to learn a thing or two about the finest transit systems in the world, you can find me at this address. Let us return to locating the Peace of Eden. We need to reclaim London from Staric. Who are my targets? It's not time for that yet. I didn't come to London to hunt Cheerios. First understand the dance, only then become the dancer. Oh, so you're taking over where father left off. Someone has to. Evie, finding the precursor artifact will give us an insight into what the Templars intend. Jacob, I have information about Staric's associates that should be of use to you. Yeah. 
Okay, now I know my targets. Cool. This soothing syrup has become the only medicine available in Lambeth. It bears the Templar Grandmaster's name. About time for a visit to the doctor. I don't see that cure arriving anytime soon. And what exactly will you be doing, might I ask? You know very well. Tracking down the Peace of Eden. Enjoy your studies. I'll be out killing Templars. Nice. Okay, good. Alright, uh, I guess first things first is that I'm gonna un unmask this entire district, so... And then after, after that I'm gonna, I guess, do this quest, yeah. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll probably just hit these two viewpoints and then I'll, I'll, I'll call it. And then next time I start, I'll, I'll start the questing process. I might uh, actually st start later tonight uh, after I come back. But I'm not sure yet. Oh, five skill points. Don't mind if I do. Please level me. Thank you. All right. This is something that I wanted really bad. Should make killing them a lot faster. Be level five. This seems really cool, but I think that this is probably better for now, because... Yeah. Actually, I should have done this before I... Oh, well, whatever. whatever. It's fine. Get down! Get out! Oh, they can't enter this door.
Hello. <laughs> just a small drop. And it just kills him. Kills her, I mean. Level four. It's gonna be a while. I don't think I'll be able to reach both of these. What happens? That's what happens. Okay. Alright. I just wanted to figure that out, you know. To see what happens when I run in front of a train. Kinda expected it, but I just wanted to be sure. Where am I? There I am, okay. I'm hoping they have something similar to the zip line in in the new one too, because that's an awesome future to have. Makes traversing a lot more fun. Yes, I'm. I'm gonna go for this one too. Might as well.
If Unity had this day, it would have been a much better game, I think, at least. This was a good idea. Like Spider-Man, <laughs> which is uh, there is a new Spider-Man coming out. On I don't know if I'm gonna get it. Probably not. We'll see, I guess. Or like Batman, yeah. Alright, well, with that, I'm done for now. So, thank you for watching this artist and, and anybody else that may be watching. And I uh, hope you have a good day. Uh, I might be back later tonight. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. So, take care. And, uh... Goodbye.